Shalom, family. Shalom. So they uh, they talk about isolation. Well, now, they talk a lot about isolation. Here lately, this epidemic of COVID or whatever they want to call it. But now, isolation leads to success. Sure enough, it does. Because... If you keep to yourself, you stay by yourself, you self-reflect, and you think about all the things, you get this mental wave, and you think about the things that you can do, you need to do, things that need to be done, things that need to be did in your life to get your life back in order or something, to get back on your feet or whatever. Now, you're... um. Your family, your natural born family might tell you, oh, no, you can't do that. You can't do this. Tell you what you can't and what you can do all the time. And um, so if, you, if you're by yourself for about, say, six months, a year, your life can change drastically. If you self-reflect on the things that you have on your heart and in your mind, in your spirit, you can correct those things through isolation to... Um, to better yourself and to, to, to succeed in what it is that you have in, in your mind, what you're thinking on. You, you know, people will tell you you can't do this and you can't do that all day long, all month long, all year long. You can't do that. You never do that. You can't do this all the time. A whole bunch of naysayers all over the place with very negative energy. So you have to get away from people who are draining your energy. You know, they, they give you, they feed you negative energy all the time and negative input, and, and you need to get away from that. You need to have good vibes, good energy, and don't let people who are negative drain your energy. You want to stay positive, keep a positive uh, energy level about yourself. Don't let people naysay. Um, just be... Isolate yourself for about, say, six months, and you, you'll find success. Isolation leads to success. Shalom. Shalom.